How you doing folks? Sunday, July 22nd, 2018. Here we are in Tucson, Arizona. And what do we have going on in the skies today? Ah, you know, same as usual. Quite obvious, geoengineering, artificial weather. Stratospheric injections. Yep, whatever you want to call it. Same thing. All kinds of artificial particulates dumped into our skies, which we're breathing, which fall down and end up in our water, food, skin, right through our flesh. No problem. Anyway. If nothing else is going well, I, I'd say that uh, one small thing is, is is the support for me. That is going well, and uh, you know we hope that. You know I I do realize here something, and I didn't realize it before. Is how important my case is. Seriously, because when they're not when they're done with me, they're coming for you next. You know that. There's no question about that. Anybody that has anything to do with activism for chemtrails, for geoengineering, oh yeah, they're going to be convicted. Sure thing. Especially if they could just get this, you know, this is the first example here in Tucson, and that little pesky guy, that Haskell guy, yeah, putting up all them damn signs. Well, we picked uh, this city to be the first in the United States that they're going to do this geoengineering yeah you know to save us what we called this one out what six years ago seven eight years ago we said that's exactly what they're gonna do and that's what they're doing right now but that dang little sign mother god darn it we don't like him here in Tucson but who knows you know what it might be the other way around they might have picked Tucson because I'm such a pesky little thorn in their side and they wanted to make sure that I'm no longer in the picture but hell they paid someone to come kill me once how the hell that, that didn't work out they probably called him again he said I, I ain't touching that motherfucker goddamn killed the shit out of him and he ain't dead I ain't doing that again it's probably what they said to him I probably sent a few others already recently and Trust me, they probably have. They went back to their boss and said, hey, I don't know, Haskell's still alive. We've done all that shit you gave us. He just ate it up, drank it, all that stuff, man. Wow, took it like a sucker. But the problem is it didn't kill him. Shot him twice. Shade off his head. <laughs> you know? I'm telling you, man, whoever's watching me, they got a job. They had a serious job. They're like, really? I just got nominated on the Haskell thing? Oh, shit. Great. That's what the alien said that probably kept me alive or whatever it was that's keeping me alive. Because I know that one thing, I'm here for a reason. Oh, yes. That is one thing I've claimed to know all my life. I did say that. Is I am here for a reason this time around. And you know what? I can't. I got to do my job problem is I don't know what that job is yet but you know what as you know I'll know when I need to do that job then I'll know what job it is I was sent here to do isn't that right God bless you unconditional love thank you again for supporting me Chris Haskell out Real news to something. They're playing God with your hair. 
Howard Meadows. The gentleman tonight who leads the Tucson group, he really believes it. He really does.